Hello. Can you see me? Can you hear me? Please confirm. Good. So, after game 25, Max Ava was leading, plus one. Just a moment. Okay. Good. So, after game 25 was... five games after because according to regulations it was 30 games yes i played in bundesliga but i played so bad i am really disappointed with my play what okay sometimes it's, it happens the chess player can be angry Okay, I I uh, didn't come here with bad mood, but well, so. morning. Okay, good morning. Nine forty forty nine in uh, in Ukraine, but okay uh, in evening, but okay for you it's morning. Well. Okay, I played against Pavel was terrible game. Oh, you, 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 how it's possible to play this? I don't understand. At my first game also was bad. So I played good theoretical line, but but then I totally collapsed. Okay, I can show you if there is question. Well, so it was my first game. My opponent was uh, Narayanan from India. So. Marshall counter attack. He is quite a good player, but uh, I have feelings that he has no good pre prepared lines. So, e4 hanging. You mean here? Yes. If I was hanging, okay, it's possible to take. It's just another line, open variation. But my opponent choose different. Hello. So after bishop e3, he played bishop g4. Rook e8, knight d2, rook e6. According to modern theory, queen h5 is more precise. And only after a4, rook uh, e6. If white starts with queen f1, Peter Leko played rook e7 in this position. It's important to avoid tricks. But okay, so queen h5 was stronger, according to modern theory. But he played uh, rook e6, queen f1, good move. Queen h5, f3. He took with rook, I took, and okay, so queen f2. What is this? So queen f2 I played after knight d5, queen f3. So I'm losing tempi. Okay. But why I did it? Because, uh, okay, my first intention, so for example, if uh, imagine that I'm playing blitz, Queen f3 immediately, without any thinking. So queen f3, this is forced, and white has pleasant and gain. But okay, I have time, so I should calculate variation, and I started to calculate variation. 
So obviously white is slightly better. Okay, probably nothing so terrible for black, but uh, unpleasant position. But uh, my problem was that uh, I was thinking that c5 is strong. So I, I played queen f2. Queen f2 is not the best. So queen f3 was uh, correct. So queen takes f3, knight takes f3. After c5, rook e1. Okay, if no c5, okay, I have pleasant position. Okay, probably black can hold it, but uh, position... It, it is not position where black can make easy draw something like this, like in the game. Uh, so c5 was my calculation. Rook e1, rook e8. Mm, unfortunately, king f2, knight g4 now. So knight g5 uh, looks like only active possibility for white. Also, I considered bishop d5, however, this idea bishop b7. It was important that I have seen this idea, but uh, in this position it, it doesn't work because after rook e7, black has everything protected. I have seen this. But okay, knight g5 was correct. I have seen knight g5. c4 only move. And now, uh, what was my calculation? So, bishop c2. He play uh, h6 or g6. Okay, both is possible. And knight e4, knight d5. And I'm not winning the piece. So in this moment, I stopped my calculation and uh, started to calculate many lines. For example, uh, here I calculate even queen g2. But uh, after queen g2, queen e6 is only only but good move for black. Queen e6 now is strong. And I stop it to calculate correct line which uh, if you have uh, I have a question. If you have 16 years old you can reach anything what you want. Believe me. Well, so queen e6, uh, but okay, so let's come back to correct line. So knight g5, correct line, so c4. So, well, what to do? First of all, uh, White has uh, alternatives. So I uh, have considered only bishop c2, but bishop d1 is also possible. So I uh, even didn't consider this idea because I didn't consider a correct idea to penetrate bishop uh, to long diagonal. And uh, my goal is b7 square. And now... My threat is bishop f3 and then bishop b7 or knight e4. So h6 looks like very logical. Okay, probably not only move, but very logical one. And simply knight h3. Unfortunately, I have no. better square for the knight, but uh, now I have idea to play bishop f3 and bishop b7, and uh, still situation is not comfortable to black. For example, if rook e6, bishop f3, if knight d5, I will not take on e6, but just play king f2, and okay, maybe black can hold position, but it's still unpleasant somehow for black. So bishop d1, I didn't see during the game. But okay, bishop c2 is... Uh, even better. And now black has choice, h6 or, or g6. And uh, after g6, what's imp very important to see that uh, uh, knight e4 is not uh, only active possibility. So after knight e4, knight d5, that's true, I have uh, nothing. But I have bishop e4. I totally missed this correct idea. And uh, after knight g4, very important to play knight f3. So 
rook f1 is possible, but after rook f1, f5, bishop d5, king g7, black has contraplay. But uh, so it was important to see bishop e4. And uh, after knight g4, to see knight f3, very strong move. And now black is in trouble because uh, bishop b7 is an uh, unpleasant threat. So, okay, maybe black can hold this position, but uh, it's not easy draw. That's a problem for black. So rook b8 is possible, bishop c6, I will play something like this. And uh, still some uh, problem for black, for example, knight f6, and I don't know, maybe king g2. If rook b6, d5, something like this. And black is still suffering because white has control uh, e line. Sometimes I will attack this pawn. Okay, maybe it's not winning, but I should play this. But I played uh, queen f2 and, and I lost the tempi, so... Queen f2, he played knight d5, I played queen f3 now. The problem here is that after rook e1, he simply played knight f6. Looks like pleasant position for white, but black has planned to play queen d7, rook e8, and uh, I didn't find anything convincing here. So I played queen f3, he took, but okay, I lost important tempi, he played rook b8, uh, and... Uh, now, okay, if imagine that uh, here he plays, uh, if I played correctly, so queen f3, probably he can play here rook b8 uh, as well, but now I can um, play something like king f2 or okay, uh, or rook e1 maybe. Probably it's not so much, but still unpleasant somehow for black. Well, for example, I can play rook e1, knight d5, rook e2 to prepare a4, something like this. So temp is always important. About uh, game a value in Dutch defense, I will demonstrate this today. So, okay. So I missed my chances to play queen f3, I played queen f2 and... Uh, it was draw, so let's uh, try to more. In, uh, let's try to come back to more interesting heroes than my stupid games in Bundesliga. Okay, so game twenty six, Max Ava White, and uh, it was Dutch defense, right? G three, uh, stupid idea. Bishop uh, e7, so, but okay, uh, if play a5, bishop g2, knight f6, knight f3, uh, b6, uh, it was uh, uh, my game against David Navarra, and uh, David played knight e5, after rook a7, knight c3, and okay, uh, mm. I don't know if black has possibility to equalize in this position. Okay, game was ended to draw, quite interesting game. But So bishop e7 is very uh, stupid line because I explained that. Uh -huh. So in previous game, uh, in previous game, uh, Alekhin played bishop f6. Okay, I uh, explained it that after bishop f6, queen c2 was the best. Ava, Ava took on uh, e4 and played knight e1. So bishop d4, bishop e4, bishop b2 was played. It, this was uh, okay, but uh, queen c2 was. Uh, Quite good. So now Alekhin played b6, so he plays a very bad version of Queen's Indian if compared with line uh, knight f6, knight f3, b6, g3, bishop b7, bishop g2, bishop e7, this, this, bishop d2, f5. So uh, Alekhin doing the same but without important tempi. So it uh, cannot be good, of course. So white has many possibilities to 
to have advantage in this position. Ava played queen c2, logical move. Of course, uh, not only move. So rook c1, d5 immediately looks good. But okay, he played queen c2. Maybe not the best. So, for example, uh, I think I would play d5 immediately with white. Bishop b7, okay. Now queen c2. Or rook c1 firstly. Or queen c2. Queen c2 is possible because knight is attacked. So if knight takes d2, I will take with knight probably. Knight c3 is hardly good because knight d4 is coming. Also rook c1, so white is playing theoretical position with extra tentis to compare with queen c d. So everything is good for white. So queen c2, bishop b7, again d5 is totally possible, of course. Probably objectively the strongest move, but Ava played knight e5, so he wants to simplify this position. So knight takes c3. Okay, knight takes d2 doesn't work because bishop b7 and bishop a8 and black is losing material. So this is uh, obviously bad. So knight takes c3. Okay, now if bishop takes b7, knight takes e2 and knight takes d4, black has to... Forced, uh, okay, uh, there is theoretical lines in Queen's Indian, also Capablanca played against Ava. I mean this, uh, bishop e7, uh, uh, ah, not bishop b7, so bishop b4, this line, this, this, castle, knight c3, knight e4, queen c2, this, knight g5, this, this, this. This, 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 queen b7, knight takes d4. It's a very interesting line. Uh, it, it was uh, three times uh, in the match Capablanca against Ava. Ava was white, Capablanca was uh, black. Bishop e1 of move 9. Bishop e1, where bishop e1, sorry. In which moment? So it was Capablanca Ava in uh, 1939. Uh, 1931, sorry. Okay, you are welcome. So b6. Queen c2, bishop b7, but knight e5, so knight takes c3, bishop c3 takes, takes. So standard position, white is probably slightly better, nothing special, however. Black has choice, uh, he played, uh, Alyokhin played queen c8, it's not totally necessary move. Black can consider c5, for example. Also d6. Okay, if d6, I understand that knight d3 is plan for white, and then knight f4, d5, something like this is cut. So c5 was interesting. Now if d5, d6, and e5 is cut, so it looks like comfortable to black. Okay, maybe uh, rook d1. Okay, black can take, and then queen c7, try knight c6, something like this. Okay, it was another game, but the c5 was at least reasonable alternative in this position. Of course, white can play in more sharp way, for example, takes, takes, e4, something like this. If d6, knight f3, or even knight d3, it's possible. This idea, if take, knight f4. 
So rook takes f4, g takes f4, d5. Okay, sharp position, but uh, I think white can be better after rook d1 and then f5 probably. Well, so Alyokhin played uh, queen c8. In my opinion, maybe not, not the best move. Okay, so maybe c5 was uh, better, but okay, so it was choice of Alyokhin. F3 played uh, Max A immediately. It wasn't necessary, so White has several alternatives. Of totally normal, so Rook A D1, for example, or, or F3 here, or something, something like this. Not okay. So D5 played Max A. Alekhin played D6. Knight d3, e5, king h1. What is this? Very difficult to understand, frankly speaking. What is idea of... Uh, so I cannot imagine myself play king h1 here. It's, it's too deep for me. Okay, I'm not sure what uh, I would play, but uh, certainly not king h1. So it's extremely deep move, so... Okay, as I understand, he wants to play f4. Uh, so I will illustrate. And then knight f2, and then g prepare g4. And for this position, king on h1 is probably better than on g2 because uh, black can, uh, because white has idea to play g4 and then rook g1. But so, but immediately Max Ava didn't want to play this. So probably, um, okay, it's uh, very creative. So uh, I'm uh, amazed with this move because uh, so probably his idea was that uh, he wants f4, e4, knight f2. And uh, probably he, he has... Uh, idea that uh, Alyokhin has no useful moves because if knight d7, probably knight b4. And, uh, idea to change plan, penetrate with knight on c6. Uh, uh, however, I don't know how strong it is. Uh, black can play knight b8, for example. But okay, after knight b8, f4. Now if a5, knight d3, white uh, wants, white has what? Okay, but after knight b4, probably black can just uh, bishop f6 not possible because queen takes f5 it's also important so very tricky move uh, okay maybe black can just play something like this rook f7 if knight c6 bishop f8 to prepare bishop uh, f uh, to prepare knight b8 but okay i don't oh or the same idea to play g6, but okay, now knight c6, f4 can be considered. Another question, how strong is f4? Black has queen e8, for example. But okay, so it's a really creative move. And you can play c6. c6 is a little bit uh, strange because um, black is playing in the flank where they are weaker. So... But uh, a5 was natural to block b4, but probably f4 was prepared and knight f2. So it, I think uh, that this was uh, plan of Mike's aim to prepare g4 and organize uh, attack in king's slump, for example, with uh, knight d7 to play g4. But okay, it's question how strong it is, uh, for example, knight c5. So I am ready to take with queen if white takes on f5. If rook g1, I can play bishop f6. So, okay, maybe this position is playable, but uh, totally possible that white is slightly better simply after e3. So now we can see deepness of uh, king h1. So g line is really useful for whites. So, okay, so how to, to play with black? Uh, Alekhin played c6. Uh, okay. He played c6. So probably he won't uh, to use some tactical motives to attack pawn d5. Okay, but uh, 
from other point of view, white can play just f3 now, and after c takes d5, c takes d5, from positional point of view, I'm not sure that this is good for black, because somewhere white has idea knight b4, knight c6, or rook a c1, simply, but uh, Ava played queen b3. King h8. Logical was c5, because queen on b3 um, less uh, active than uh, on c2, and uh, after f4, e4, knight f2, black can do probably same plan. So knight on bishop f6. If, for example, g4, well, now probably even e3 is possible to consider. And then f takes g4 somehow. Or after g4, just take on c3 and to play knight d7 and prepare knight f6. g4, knight c5, g5. Uh, g4, uh, but where knight c5? Yes, 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 yes. Uh, king h1 is a very tricky move. Okay, so king h8 played Alochin, logical to avoid d takes c6 and c5, or immediately c5. Because, for example, if black plays something like this, c5 can be really strong. Maybe, but uh, I'm not sure because this. Ah, now even uh, this is possible to consider something like this. So, if rook b8, knight takes c6 is coming. It's not so difficult, but nice variation. Previous slide, uh, knight c5. Ah, g5, you mean to play. Mm, also possible, but... Uh, Yes, g5 is also possible, and then rook g1, rook g3 is somehow. Yes, black has problem. Yes, g5 is possible. Agree. Yes, yeah. uh, h4 or even uh, rook g1, rook g3, rook h3, some, uh, try to attack h7. Yes, white has certainly more pleasant. Somewhere even white can seem to transfer knight uh, to d4. Okay, it uh, needs some, some time, but uh, black has no serious contraplay here. Queen a6 and b5 is possible, but pawn c7 can be weak. Yes, I agree that the uh, position is more pleasant for white. So, so probably king h1 is a great move, uh, I need to admit. Uh, also, very, uh, okay, probably... Uh, uh, there is question, why not bishop f6? Bishop f6 is logical. More logical than uh, c6, because now if uh, f4, e4, okay, so it's uh, more easy to defend. And knight still on b8, so knight b4, knight c6 is, doesn't uh, work. C6. So c6 is dubious in my opinion. Bishop f6, I think, was the strongest move in this position. Okay, probably now Max A were planning to play f3 and then e4, something like this. But it's still slightly better. Okay, but c6, queen b3. Okay, queen b3 not necessary, so white can play any move. For example, rook a c1 looks like logical in my opinion. For example, if takes, takes, queen c4, it's not necessary, but uh, well, we can consider this. So if knight b4, a5 is coming. So. 
if knight a4 b a5 if b3 queen c5 i close in the pot queen b3 takes takes what is this quite pleasant end game for white okay, because you see six square is big human move okay so but uh, okay maybe human but uh, okay uh, what is my characteristic of natural move so for example if i am playing blitz very hard to believe that i would play king h1 so it's i would play something else probably f3 with idea e4 probably f4 immediately probably rook a e1 and uh, also logical idea to prepare e4 so it's uh, this move in my opinion more natural than king h1 but ava played king h1 okay in my opinion bishop f6 was the base for for alohim it has nothing special okay f3 in my opinion the best for white and go on okay but c6 queen b3 king at now f4 so knight f2 still possible but uh, okay now after knight f2 black probably has knight a6 knight will go to c5 with tempi okay. so a will decide to play knight b4 <clears throat> so he sees uh, a good square e3 for his knight and at the moment uh, black cannot uh, develop easy his knight from b8 so c5 knight c2 knight d7 he played knight d7 here but uh, more natural was bishop f6 because bishop on c3 is uh, unpleasant for black so bishop f6 White should play knight e3 or take on f6 first and knight e3. Okay, still white is slightly better because king rook g1, g4. So, okay, so um, I am impressed with king h1. If it is even not the strongest move, but uh, we see that the uh, idea rook g1 and g4 can annoy opponent in many variations. So Alohin played knight d7, knight e3, and now he played bishop f6. Mm, go for g5 now. So. Okay, not so pleasant uh, to play for black, but uh, okay, he, after bishop f6, he allowed combination. Mm, uh, white is giving the piece, taking three pawns. So probably Alekhin underestimated this, so he could play something else here. But what exactly is another? Maybe queen e8. Maybe knight f6 was possible, but anyway, it's position not pleasant for black. So after bishop f6. Brave decision, so three pawns. Queen b8. Only move, because if queen c7, uh, knight b5, White wins immediately, so queen b8 only move, knight takes e4, so white has three strong uh, pawns in the chamber, bishop f6, knight d2. So white won, Max ever wants to push uh, his pawns as soon as possible, of course uh, other moves are not forbidden, but uh, it's logical. Black need to do something, and uh, Max Ava played g5. Okay, another possibility to contraplay probably was b5. If c takes b5, a6, something like this. But okay, g5. So he's looking for contraplay. e4 takes, takes. So e5 is prepared. Bishop d4, e5. Queen e8 played Alekhin. Okay, so knight takes e5, it's possible to consider, but if knight takes e5, white can just take and play knight f3. 
22 or so. And then black will take on b2 and they have chances for draw, although still not so pleasant. For example, here, knight g5, white pawn, d5 is pretty dangerous. Okay, so queen e8 played e6, rook g8. So what is this? If e takes d7, of course, queen e2. Queen g2 is mate, mate in threat. Again, white has choice. Knight of played next state. Brave decision. After queen g6, he played rook g1. So bishop takes g1, rook takes g1. So white is rook down, but okay. He is fighting for initiative. Queen f6 played Alehim. If knight e4 was possible, knight e4 looks logical. Uh, here, knight e4, yes, it was possible, but uh, lose. Why not? If knight f6, knight d6 probably is strong. This idea, knight f7 check. And, but okay, it's not so clear. Because knight f7, king g7, so rook g1 is not made. Because takes and, and black has knight g4 ideas. Knight g5, queen h5, so. Ava consider uh, the bishop on d4 like his main enemy, not, not the knight. So because of this, he played knight f6. Okay, it wasn't only move, of course. Maybe this also was possible. Mm, but anyway, after queen g6, I need to play something like queen h3, probably. Now knight is hanging, so knight f6. Now probably something like knight f3. This idea to prepare f5, but uh, black has this idea, it's impossible. Important not miss this. But okay, after knight e4, white can play simply rook e2. Oh, yes, knight e4 was uh, interesting, but Ava played knight f3. Queen f6. Queen f6 is not obvious for me, so. It was possible to play queen f5, for example. E takes d7, rook takes g1, check. Okay, you are not spamming, you are proposing interesting moves. Ah, yes, 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 Brunstein Lyubovich from Alekhin Defense. Very nice game. I will write for myself. Bronstein Lyubovich. That you are interested. Yes, it was a great game. Okay. My pants doesn't work. Bronstein Lyubovich. Alekhin. Yes. Queen f3 or queen h3? In which moment? Uh, here, queen f3 or queen h3. Okay, it's possible, but uh, after knight f6, uh, pawn is hanging, so f5 is possible, but okay, probably queen e7, and then black wants to play rook g7, rook g8, something like this. So, okay, a sharp position, uh, but okay, we'll see what happens. So, queen f5. 
Queen e4, uh, of course, not possible because queen c6. So queen f5 is possible, rook takes g1. I don't know if white has serious winning uh, chances here. Well, for example, this. Maybe I will play rook g8. King f2. Just queen takes d7. Two pawns against exchange. Sharp position, okay, but um, I'm not sure is that white is clearly better here. Why? Queen c3 check against queen f5. Okay. Queens. Ah, queen c3 check against queen f5? What is this if knight f6? No, queen c3 it's bad because now white is rook down and compensation is knight g5, okay. But for example, this I don't see real threat. Okay, knight f7 was a real threat, but after rook g6, what you want? This doesn't look okay. Maybe queen e5 is possible, but it's I'm not sure. e7, okay. Maybe queen e5 now enters e7, okay. But for example, this. Now black is ready to play knight e4 or take on f4. Okay, uh, interesting, but not con uh, so. I think e takes d7 is correct move, but okay. So after takes takes and rook g8 or even immediately queen takes d7. The situation is not clear. So it was very natural choice because uh, uh, to take. Uh, uh, strong pawn as soon as possible. I mean pawn on d7. So Alyokhin didn't. So he played queen f6. What is uh, what he wanted? I don't know. Probably after e takes d7, he wanted to take on f. No, okay, uh, to f4 immediately he cannot take because queen c3 check, of course. But uh, he could take here. But uh, he can do same with queen f5. So king takes g1 and now takes on e4. But uh, if this was logic, uh, so why not queen f5? Because from f5, black uh, can consider uh, two captures. To d7 or to f4. From f6, uh, there is only one capture to f4. So, so I don't understand, frankly speaking, what was the reason for Alyokhin not playing queen f5. But he played queen f6 and Max Ava played knight g5. Ah, so maybe here knight g5 was possible as well. Mm, but. Um... But why now I can play even h6? And what is my problem? Yes, h h6 is possible. Why have h7 square? Aha! But after queen f6, Ava played knight. Okay, it takes d7 was uh, also reasonable alternative. We can consider this. So takes takes. Uh, so queen takes f4, he wants to play odd. Well, but uh, pawn d7 still alive. Okay, probably it's not uh, such a dangerous for black. For example, queen c3, king g8, knight e5, rook d8. Still situation is very unclear.
Okay, but black can do same with queen on f5. So queen f5 certainly was the best move. Okay, but now knight g5, now there is important difference that black cannot play h6 because knight f7 and queen c2 check or queen d3 check. It's very important difference. So rook g7 is forced because knight f7 is threat. Okay, maybe rook f8 is possible, but after rook f8... Can be something unpleasant. I don't know what exactly. Queen h3, something like this. Queen h3 might be possible. If queen f5. Just take and take on d7, but the situation is unpleasant somehow for black. For example, rook g3 and then king g2, king f3, king e4, something like this. Okay, so Alohin played rook g7, e takes d7, rook takes d7, queen e3. So now white has strong for post for knight, uh, e6. Also, queen e5 can be positional threat. But okay, still situation is not clear for me. For example, rook g7 was possible. If queen e5 takes, takes, uh, okay, but now uh, this is winning for knight. And knight on e5, can we just go with queen g3? Aha. Uh -huh. Mm, in this position, so queen g3. Okay, queen g3. If I take and king g7, my king f6 is coming. If I correctly understand your question, no, this is bad for white because king f6. So white has no time to put king on f4 or to e4 to protect knight. So queen g3 is not good. Okay, but uh, why it should play something else? Uh, what exactly? It's not obvious question. Okay, maybe just waiting for B3 something like this, because for black it's not so easy to play as well. If, for example, King F8, Knight C6 is possible. This idea. And now white is winning. Okay, but uh, it's cooperative light. Uh, uh, queen g5 is strong. And only after king f2 to take here. Because now if queen h8, black has queen g8. This is important. So, okay, knight g5 played max a rook g7. Uh, so if rook g7, queen e5 is really unpleasant, but uh, I'm thinking about rook f8, but maybe knight e6 now in that situation. Black has serious problem against uh, white pawns because after rook f5, d6 winning immediately. Pawn takes... Uh, so what... Well... So queen e3, rook e7 he played. Knight e6. Rook f8 he played. Okay. So 
Black has chances to survive here. But what to play? If queen takes b2, d6 is unpleasant somehow. So probably this was a chance if queen e5 just take, 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 take. So black is pawned down, but if rook e1, king g7, and then king g6, king f5, it is draw. So rook g5, but h6, and how white can win this? It looks like draw. Because after rook h5 or rook f5, black just playing king f king g7 and king g6, so it seems like draw. So what else? Okay, white can, well, now white can play any moves like b3, for example. The uh, situation still unpleasant for black. So queen f5 is just not the best, but Alekhin played rook f8, but now queen e5 will stand this one. It's a different story. Rook f5, rook e1. h6 played. h6, so frankly speaking, I not understand the reason. Uh, king g8 looks uh, the most natural, but but in that case, king g2. But okay, so this, this, and king f8. The problem for white if rook f1, uh, rook takes, king takes, king e7, and white lost both of these pawns. So now it looks like white, black has excellent chances to survive. Okay, probably not king g2, but what else? d6 doesn't work because rook takes e6, d7, rook f8. So king g2 looks like the most... Okay, h3, h4, I can do same. Take on e6 and king f8. So it, it not prevent my plan. So this what I want. And then king is a, ah, rook g1. Okay, rook g1 uh, is possible, but... Well, I can play even this. Ah, no, no, sorry, this not because rook g2. Okay, so I will take this. Because I think it should be enough for draw. Of course, white has chances, rook f1 check, but uh, rook end game, so it looks like drawish. So king g8 was very logical move, but h6, strange move, and now white can play king g2, it's better position. But uh, 98, so uh, this motive was impossible with uh, king on g8. Now black cannot take, so h6 was mistake. 98, and now black cannot stop e6, so e7, b5. Okay, now situation is very hard for black. For example, rook takes d6, rook d2, knight e5 is possible. Okay, why it is not winning immediately? Okay, so after rook b2, probably something else. Rook d1 just we take. Smart move. Rook d1 and black has no defense against uh, d6, d7. So rook takes b2 was bad. b5 he played. Knight d8 again. So beautiful. He wants knight f7 check and knight d6. Might be impressive. 
Of course, uh, maybe uh, other moves uh, are strong in this position, but knight d8 is really impressive. Maybe the uh, same idea works with knight x e7 simply. Oh, yeah. B takes c4, knight b5. It looks like uh, black is losing as well. Okay, maybe now black can try this. Okay, hard to believe that this is a real chance to survive. The winning for white. Okay, maybe king g3, rook takes b2. Knight d5 simply, yes, this is winning. So knight takes a7 was enough as well, the same idea too. Yes, b3 also possible, everything. But knight d8 is quite direct way to win. Rook e6, knight d6, knight e4. Bravo, Max Ava. What can I say? So, after such a beautiful victory, he has uh, plus two. But Alyokhin still fighting. And uh, in the next game, Alyokhin white. So, I will see from Max Ava's side. So, because he was winner. Flip board. He played e5. Knight c3, Vienna game. So, uh, why Alekhin played this? Because uh, in previous game he had some problem in open Spanish. So, in this position was one game. Uh, Alekhin uh, had bad position. Chess books, I don't know. Bronstein book about Zurich. Probably. Many books of uh, Yakov Nietzsche For example, for example, about this book. I like. Nikoronovane Chimpione Mir. This author wrote many nice books. Also, very nice. Can you see clearly? Also, was a very nice book uh, written by Nikitin and Vasukov. It's about Philidor, La Bourdonnais, Taunt, and Anderson Morphy. Also, very nice book was written by Vasukov and Nikitin about Chigorin. Maybe I have this in my... I will check. But... Ah, yes. Please. Mm, so, in previous uh, games, Alekhin had uh, some problem with. Okay. So, Knight C3. And now black has choice. Black can play knight f6, black can play knight c6. So knight f6 played the max Ava. Knight c6 also possible. And now white can play. Very sharp move. f4, e takes f4, knight f3. And uh, according to theory, main line is g5, but pretty interesting bishop c5, which Vadim Milov played uh, against me in Blitz game. So after d4, knight takes d4, knight takes d4, queen h4 check. Now g3, uh, fg3, bishop g2 takes this sharp position, but black is fine. And uh, if uh, king e2, d5 is strong. 
And uh, suddenly, white has nothing better than knight takes d5. So, knight takes d5 is the best move. So knight takes d5 is the best move because if uh, white is doing something else, black is better. But now it's just a draw. Bishop g4 check. Knight f3 check. The knight f3, bishop takes f3. Now if take with king, this is just made. Black is winning. Добрый вечер. So the best for white is to take with pawn, but now it's draw by perpetual check. But the most popular line is g5. If, for example, d4, g4, bishop c4, g takes f3, castle, knight takes d4. Idea if queen takes d4, queen g5 is very strong with two threats uh, take on g2 with mate or bishop c5. If bishop takes f4, black has two options. Bishop g7 is possible or bishop c5 is possible as well. Of course, after knight c6, white can play bishop c4 as well. Or just knight f3 for knights. Well... <clears throat> knight f6. Bishop c4 played. Knight takes e4. <clears throat> was choice of my x a where not necessary. Knight c6 is totally normal move uh, here. Now if d3 black has idea knight a5 to exchange bishop. If knight f3 knight takes e4 is possible. Nothing wrong with bishop c5. Knight takes e4. Knight takes e4 d5. Bishop d3 takes, takes, bishop d6, uh, bishop d6, castle, castle, and this is equal position. Okay, one located. Black has no, uh, white has no advantage in this line. But okay, knight takes e4 immediately, queen h5, knight d6, only move, bishop d3. Bishop e7. So knight c6 is possible as well, but this is very sharp line because uh, white has rook up. So. And then bishop d7. So also possible to play same with queen on e7. So okay, but this is sharp line. According to modern theory, white is better, but it's quite complicated. <clears throat> yeah, well, bishop e7, solid line. Knight f3, knight c6. Okay, uh, now instead of knight f3, queen takes e5. And uh, now it's modern theory now. Knight f3, queen f4 is possible. So I recommend to see game Firuzja Aronian to everybody who are interested in this, this line. But okay, after knight f3, knight c6, good move. Knight takes e5, and now a took with knight. This is not the best. Correct is g6. G6, I played here against Vichy. And black has no problem at all because if take on c6, just d takes c6, and black has very comfortable development, knight f5, knight d4. So if after g6, uh, queen e2, knight d4 is coming, and then black will take on b3, uh, uh, no problem for blacks. Black can equalize uh, in a very comfortable way this position. So, but okay, uh, it was later. 
So G6 was stronger, Max A that took on E5, this is not so good. Because now Queen uh, on E5 is stronger uh, than this Knight uh, on G1 and Knight uh, on B8, because Black has no idea Knight C6. So Castle, Knight D5, of course, Rook E8. Uh, knight d5, uh, logical move because if immediately castle, bishop f6 is possible. Although maybe it's uh, now queen f4 and knight d5 is coming, so maybe still unpleasant somehow for black because knight on d6 is uh, a little bit misplaced. But okay, maybe after castle, knight e8 can be considered as idea to prepare c6, d5, something like this. Rook e1, anyways, bishop d6, queen h5, c6, if knight e4, bishop e7, d4, d5, okay, black just in time, but. До свидания. But okay, so Alyokhin played knight d5 immediately, rook e8. Castle, bishop f8, queen f. So he has some pressure because uh, black has some problem with development. What to do? C6. Maybe b6. Ah, b6 not possible because knight takes c7. Rook e8. But. So uh, I mean this line. If knight takes f7, queen takes c7, if this, this. But uh, now I'm not so sure because g5. So knight takes c7 probably doesn't work because g5 is possible. And the situation is very unclear. I'm not sure is it okay. I'm not sure how white can attack. Uh, so, for example, if queen f3, black can just take uh, knight. It takes bishop b7. And now white is just losing. So probably after g5, uh, white should try something uh, creative like this. If queen takes c7, okay, queen takes g5, bishop g7, so maybe d3, but okay, what is this? White is pissed down and um, nothing forcing h6, okay, after h6, okay, h6, h4 maybe, I don't know, but okay, it uh, looks like very, very unclear. For example, queen c6 takes knight f5 is possible. So very, very unclear what is this. So, uh, okay, if not knight, if knight takes c7 doesn't work, so b6 is logical move. Now if uh, d4 bishop a6 is very comfortable for black, rook is attacking and black uh, is prepared for bishop g4. Селезнев Алехин, окей. Стэнли Алехин, окей, окей. Окей, so after uh, b6, maybe d3 is more precise, but, uh, but well, it should be 7. Queen takes g5 in previous position, where queen takes g5? So we are considering b6 if uh, if not if knight takes c7 g5. Okay, we have g5 here and what you want? Queen takes g5 not possible because your pawn still on d2. Okay, queen takes g5. Ah, here queen takes g5. Okay, it's possible, bishop g7. But where is serious attack? 
Hmm, for example, D3, you should be seven. Well, it has only two pawns uh, against uh, piece, so I don't see really serious threats. Uh, After bishop e3, rook e5 is coming, for example. So b6 was resolved. Okay, but uh, d3 is correct for white. If bishop b7, bishop d2, and still situation is not so pleasant for, for black. So Ava played c6. Natural move, knight e3, queen a5. Hardly natural move. No, more natural, in my opinion, to play b6 and then to develop bishop as soon as possible. But still d3 and then bishop d2, rook a e1, still. Not so comfortable for black. Not okay. Queen a5 played. Max a little bit artificial move. But uh, not easy to, to play for. Maybe queen e7 was more logical to prepare queen e4. If d3, queen e5. But still unpleasant somehow after queen e5, queen f3, and what to do with this pressure, not so clear. So queen a5, d4, queen h5. So very original way to defend the pawn, and now black wants to play knight e4, so very creative. But the uh, only question, how strong is objectively? Simply c3 played Alyokhin. Now he played knight e4. Not obvious choice. For me, maybe knight b5 is interesting. Prepare d5. Also, bishop d6 is threat somehow. And how to play this white? Maybe just bishop d1, queen g6, and a4 now, something like this. Also, this can be considered. If, if queen takes d6, my idea, queen takes d1. But uh, I'm afraid that this is. Uh, can be problem with knight queen g3 or queen f4 and then uh, if queen h5 a4 is coming knight is trapped if queen a4 knight f5 is so knight b5 yes bishop b1 so uh, queen g6 is correct but now a4 and uh, knight needs to go back to d6 to same bad position so, uh, so c3 very tricky. It's good. Uh, it's very natural position only because prepare bishop c2 or bishop d1, but uh, tricky tactically. But uh, another question that uh, I don't see direct threat from white now. 
So what was problem to play b6, for example? And prepare bishop a6 or bishop b7. White has no serious. Okay, bishop d1. Queen. Queen g6, or even queen a5 probably is possible. Okay, queen g6 more natural, bishop c2. Queen e6. Okay, probably. Okay, more pleasant position for white, of course, but uh, I don't see anything terrible. Okay, uh, trade of queens depends of concrete position. If uh, just now image that without queens, of course, it's more easy for black because uh, white has some attacking ideas with queen h4, for example, but uh, okay. But queen h4, h6. So b6 was a logical idea in this position, in my opinion. But Ava played knight e4, he wants bishop d6, but okay, f3. His plan is stop it because if bishop d6, of course, bishop takes f7 is coming. And after forced line, white has spawned up. So small trick. So knight needs to go back. He played g5. Other moves. Knight f6. Knight f6 uh, can be problem with g4. Because now if queen g6, bishop c2 is coming. Queen somehow trapped. So knight d5 is the only move. Now white has choice. So knight takes d5, queen takes b2, knight c7. It's one option, I'm not sure. Or just uh, simply something like this, queen g3. If queen e6, bishop b7. Unpleasant for black. Sharp line, uh, I'm not so sure. Okay, maybe it works, but this. It works as well. But who knows? Okay, but uh, white is rook up and uh, black has no. If d5, bishop e3 somehow to prepare rook f2, so maybe it works as well. So this is tactical problem. Yeah, black plays knight f6. And if queen a5, g5 is coming, which is unpleasant. So because of this, uh, Ava played knight g5, but uh, of course, uh, position of knight is d5. No, direct strike to play h4. Also, I have a question. Is it possible to play bishop c5 here? h4, h6. <clears throat> but okay, it uh, looks like probably very dubious because in this line x takes, takes, d takes c6, and then white will take on f7. It's pretty unpleasant. So Ava took on d5, knight takes d5, now white is positionally much better. Queen g4. Again, 
Queen G6 played A1. So he was afraid of uh, attack on F7, but uh, why not just take? He played B6. So knight C7, I think, doesn't work because black can just take after check. King H8 after take check and take here. And I don't see what white can do here. If before important that oh, there is only move bishop b6. Ah, not only because bishop a6 is possible as well. Bishop a6 or bishop d6, both are good. So bishop b6, for example. Black is prepared for bishop e6, and bishop b7. So if knight c7 doesn't work, so what is problem? Black is ready for bishop a6, rook c8, something like this. There is question why queen g4, so queen g3 probably more interesting for white. Or even queen e4 to pre uh, prevent b6 somehow, b6, knight f6. So queen g4 wasn't necessary, but now it looks like very logical to take and b6. And no idea what could Max Ava afraid because it's very natural. If black, if white not go, not doing any something special. Okay, for example, bishop d2, bishop a6, simply rook. Uh, okay, if rook f2, bishop c5. If rook f3, e even bishop e2 is possible to consider, or knight g5 is possible to consider. So okay, bishop e2, why not? So it looks like. Uh, Black has uh, no problem at all. If rook g3, for example, just rook c8 to prepare bishop c4. So very strange moment, actually. So probably queen g4 is not the best move, but uh, very strange choice of Ava, why he didn't take. So here looks like, of course, more pleasant position for white, but... Uh, Okay, bishop e3 normal move, but okay, bishop a6, rook f2, okay, what else? Okay, rook c8, so, and again I want, ha ha ha, good question, is there first or second march? So I will tell that, uh, <coughs> that, uh, Okay, it was second match. If you mean uh, all matches be between uh, Alyokhin and Ava, it was second match. Because first match they played in uh, 1926. Alyokhin won plus one. So this uh, second match in uh, 1935, Ava won plus one. And uh, third match against uh, these great players was in 19. 37 and uh, much revenge, Alyokhin won. Okay, but probably now it's not so easy, but uh, for example, if g5, bishop c4, bishop takes c4, rook takes c4, rook f1. Okay, it's possible, of course, but black has knight c7. So knight takes c7 is forced and and simply rook takes c7 and nothing special. Ah, rook takes f7 now, sorry. I missed rook takes f7. So, okay, bishop e3. Bishop a6, normal move. Rook f2, rook c8, normal move. g5. So, maybe not bishop c4. Maybe bishop c5 is possible, for example. To exchange the bishops. Yes. Why not? Ah, however, white can take.
Были другие матчи, да, 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 были другие матчи. Но я просто начал. Почему уже который стрим? Ну, матч длинный. К тому же я разбирал уже и другие матчи. Я разбирал матч Стейница с Андерсоном, например. Андерсона с Морфи. Так что я не только матч Эйва Алехи. Но этот матч длинный, я уже разначил, решил до конца его. Уже осталось там пять партий, тоже доведу до конца, потом уже. Будут другие темы, если у вас есть пожелания, можете их высказать. Как, какие матчи вы бы хотели, чтобы я разобрал. Окей. Okay. So. Не, не, не в историческом. Говорю, любой матч, so if, uh, f, uh, it's question for all spectators, so if there is wishes to consider uh, some matches, uh, world championship matches or candidates matches, uh, please write me, I, I can consider them. So this match, okay, I consider it because uh, I started, uh, this match uh, was quite long, so I want to finish them. So bishop c5 is possible. Bishop c4 maybe it's... It's not good, because after rook f1, black has no way to defend f7 pawn suddenly. Also, my bishop c5 is possible. Rook takes f7. Knight takes g5, rook takes d7. What is this? Rook takes e3 is possible, however. What's this? King h1, h6 or h5. I'm clear, I mean. Good game for Karokan. For Karokan. Which line of Karokan? Knight c3 or e5 or f3. Okay, but which line? With e5 or with knight c3? In Karoka. Or f3 or Panova attack. Okay, so which line of Karoka? Please specify. So, okay, so queen takes g4 was very natural, and uh, okay, black is slightly worse, but uh, very good uh, chances to hold the position, in my opinion. But Ava played queen g6, so probably he was afraid some threats on f line. Okay, but uh, he's losing tempo, so bishop e3, queen takes g6, rook f8, rook c8, king f8. So white has a pleasant position, <clears throat> because uh, because simply structure, so on d7 is isolated and uh, black has no compensation. e5 line. Okay, so I will prepare. Okay, e5, bishop f5. I will comment my game against Karpo, which I lost. Or which I won. I won against Karpo after e5. Won, well, I lost. So, okay. Oh, I lost both of them. I don't remember, so. Bishop c5 played. Okay, position is unpleasant. So bishop c5, probably not the best. Bishop c5, and bishop takes d5. What is this? So, so 
Bishop takes d5, not pleasant choice, but uh, if rook takes c5, uh, knight takes b6, it's a big problem for black. A takes b6, rook takes b7. If b takes c5, uh, if b takes c5, what is problem? Probably just knight e3, it's a positional problem. And rook will penetrate to d6. So, a the rook, but this is b4. Knight e6. If knight a4, probably bishop b3 simply puts on takes d7. Very unpleasant for black. So knight e6, bishop takes e6. Rook d8. Okay, folks, black has problem with king. Okay, but uh, it's not obvious that. Uh, this is losing position for black. Of course, uh, white could play something else, like simply bishop b3, for example. Something like this, but okay, let's consider this. So, rook b3. So, rook b3 looks like uh, losing of tempi because uh, correct place for rook is a3, not b3. Okay, for example, uh, why black should lost? It's not obvious for me. For example, g5 immediately if b5. Mm, okay, rook a3, for example. Or maybe even uh, not g5, maybe even e5. Uh, idea to have uh, uh, pass uh, to have a pawn pass a pawn as soon as possible. F5, e4. So if b5, rook a3, or f5, immediately. It's, it's very unclear for me why black should lost this endgame. Okay, white is better, but okay, maybe just rook a3. Rook a6, okay, f5, okay, maybe rook takes b6 and rook e6, but anyway, it's, it's ah, so uh, e4, so takes, takes. Something like this, but um, okay. White has been in chances, but it's um, <clears throat> is it possible to win for white in this position. I'm not sure how to win. For example, if king d2, I will just play rook b5, for example. I can win this. If king c3, e3. So for example, king c3, e3, king c4, rook b2. It looks like draw, by the way. But Ava played rook b3. Okay, probably he was in time trouble, I don't know. But rook b3, very strange move, because uh, obvious that white is planning b5. So. He played g5, king e2, only now e5, king d2, f6. So. 
Okay, but now he is late, so white has idea king c2. So if f5 now, king c2, and then a5 in b6, for example. Now it's but but, but still uh, rook d3. Because a5, uh, rook d5 is possible. Yeah. So still after f5, it looks like black has chance. Okay, very unpleasant. Maybe rook a6 and then take here and then king c3. This can be really unpleasant. But okay, A would decide not to do anything and uh, rook b4, okay. rook a6, so rook a6. Okay, so very bad game, uh, I, very bad uh, play uh, by Max Ava in endgame, but quite interesting game also from theoretical point of view. Thank you. And uh, last game for today will be um, Ava with white, Alohin with uh, black, so it will be game 28, right? 28, yes. So d4, knight f6, so I will flip board again. So Ava has uh, uh, only plus one. Three games left. So we are close to the finish. Let's see for d5 played Alohi. Doesn't want to play Nimtso India before he played this line. Bishop g5, bishop e7, e3, knight bd7, knight f3, castle, rook c1, c6, bishop d3. And uh, d takes c4 and knight d5 here was played in match between Alohin and Capoblanc many times. Francuski Zahid Chumu, Koristuice, Hraice, what? Jane Dalma Hraus Sharic in the preclad variant, Slon d7, Slon c6. Možda Hrati i Francuski Zahid. Duda často Hraje Francuski Zahid Chorven in the preclad. Цілком користується попитом. Венс Лісо грає французький захист. So h6, bishop h4. Now to play knight d5 is possible as well, but now white can avoid the exchange of bishop with bishop g3. And if knight takes c3, b takes c3, b6, castle, bishop b7. Now queen e2 is best in my opinion. By the slightly better idea, rook f1. <clears throat> e4 is not so strong because knight f6. Idea if e5, knight e4, and then c5 is coming. Queen e2 is stronger. Strongest move in my opinion. Alekhin played b5, bishop d3, a6, and now. According to theory, uh, the best for white is uh, a4. And uh, white is better. <clears throat> if uh, somebody interested with this line, I rec uh, strongly recommend to see game Kamsky against Salov. Kamsky won beautiful game with white. So a4 is strong move. Why is white better? Because uh, black cannot push c5. 
this is problem. If b4, white can just take and play knight e4 and black has problem with c6. If b takes a4, knight takes a4, it was uh, Kamsky sal. So somewhere black plays uh, queen a5, but it was not uh, enough for equality. So please uh, see it, but, but a, a played e4. Knight takes e4, natural reaction. Bishop takes e4, bishop takes e7, knight takes e3, looks like black is okay. Черные пытаются слонов разменять. Не меняют слона, они просто... A4, uh, what is the plan? Okay, uh, queen A5 check probably, um, but not just knight D2. So I remember something like this. Bishop B4, knight C3. C5, castle, C takes D4, knight D3, and then knight takes D4, something like this. It was Kamsky Sal. Of course, if I am not mixing anything. Rook is. Okay, not so obvious that uh, rook A7 or rook B8 is better, but okay, rook A7 is quite natural. So castle knight b6 again black has choice maybe when bishop e7 is possible with the idea if d5 knight b8 i don't know how strong it is but it can be considered right idea and then rook c7 okay knight b6 played knight e4 Bishop e7, knight e5. So isolated pawn, but white has active pieces. Knight c5. And black has no weakness at all. Probably b3 was possible, but after b3, knight d5. Idea. Knight b4 is coming. Okay, certainly e, e4 is not the strongest, so a4 was strong. And now, black is better. Okay, let's see. What's this? White is fighting for equality. Okay, maybe nothing special, but unpleasant for sure for white. Queen d5 just possible for black. Looking cook. D6, a4. So what is this? Why a4? He's given the pawn somehow. Well, probably he just didn't see defense against rook d8. But is it so serious? Okay, for example, if I play just f3, rook d8. And uh, so queen takes c5, now it's not a threat because uh, my queen is protected. So just h4. Ah, h4, f6. Ah, this is problem. Доброго вечера. F6, and now if knight g6, queen takes c5 is winning. So h4 is already decisive mistake. Okay, so after rook d8, I need to, to play queen c3. What now? Queen takes d4, takes, takes, takes. Hmm. 
Yes, Black lost the pawn. So Rook C7 is possible, of course, or Knight takes F7 is possible, but Rook D1 and Rook D2 is coming. Ну так вы спросите, почему ход хороший? Какой конкретный ход? Я вам попробую объяснить на понятном уровне. Разменять чернополь. А, в дебюте имеете в виду, что конь d5 пойти имеете вместо b5? Или что вы имеете в виду? Окей, okay, good question. So, um, question was why uh, black wants to exchange these bishops. Uh, also, we can consider Lasker system. Same idea. Black is playing knight e4. Yes, uh, knight h5, uh, Karpov Korchnoi, yes. Uh, Knight h5, you mean uh, this uh, Karpo Korch, uh, uh, no, yes, this. Yes. Knight h5, yes. Okay, so, uh, but uh, if just in this position, white has more space. So, for black, uh, if uh, you have less space, uh, it's uh, good to exchange pieces. And also, with uh, this exchange, black is prepared to e5. So, for example, this, this. If uh, Alyokhin played knight e4 against Capablanca, but, for example, if castle, black can take on c3 and play e5. So, this is classical Capablanca system. Bishop f4, okay, it's possible, it's, but it's a matter of taste. You mean uh, here, Bishop F4? Okay, it's possible. There is another standard idea. Black can take on C3, can take on B4 as well. Uh, F4 as well. Maybe just in this position the best for black to take and B6. Uh, but uh, if h6, uh, again, uh, uh, so if this, this, h6 is useful tempi for black. So, but now white has idea bishop g3 not allow exchange of bishop immediately. То есть uh, я пытаюсь объяснить, что когда у вас меньше пространства, то в принципе надо стараться менять фигуры. В данном случае слонов. Ну и к тому же, вот так, когда такая структура, значит, e3, d4 против c6, e6, то как-то черным нужно либо c5, либо e5 провести. И размен слонов со стороны черных облегчает проведение хода e5. Надеюсь, я понятно объяснил. I'm trying to explain. Well, so so after e4 and several moves, uh, Ava was in trouble. Also important that, for example, queen c3, rook d8 is possible, and rook c7 is queen takes e5. Okay, but maybe white can try h3 somehow. If rook d8, now queen c3, maybe this is... Because now queen d4 takes, takes, knight takes f7, black has no idea, rook d1, rook d2 check and take on b2. So probably white has good chances to hold the position. Or maybe or even with pawn on h4. 
uh, my point uh, y pawn on h4 maybe if uh, f6 i want to have knight g6 and then h5 idea i'm not sure as this is good but uh, it's pretty interesting for example this 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 rook c7 so bishop g2 doesn't work because h5 White is winning now. Also possible, however, was uh, rook c8 firstly with king f7. Now h5 and bishop is hanging. And also rook f8 mate. So this is idea to play h4. So queen takes d4, but but after queen takes d4, in some variation, pawn can be hanging. So this is. Uh, disadvantage but uh, how big are chances to win for black i don't know if rook takes uh, h4 knight d6 for example so okay white could try something else but uh, position is not pleasant for sure so max a were played a4 he gave pawn b takes a4 played alohin very logical decision also, why? Uh -huh. So if rook d8, a takes b5 probably. If f6, now knight c6. Black is not winning because if queen takes c5, knight takes d8. <clears throat> so this is important trick. Black can take on b5, however, but um, queen takes b, rook takes b5 is impossible because bishop e a6, of course. If queen takes b5, black can play queen takes d4. Still, situations unpleasant for white. Black has many tactical threats. Queen takes b2, for example, is threats at the moment with rook d1 mate. Or queen takes c5. Rook, rook c1, probably. White should play. Yes, maybe white can hold the position after rook c1. If queen e4, knight f3 is the point. h3, a possible position. h3 may be possible as well, but I uh, was afraid about bishop a6 somehow. But bishop a6, queen a5, maybe h3 even more logical. Maybe you are right. Okay, but Alyokhin just took the pawn. Why not? Knight c4. He is extra pawn and uh, and uh, d4 pawn is weak, so black has excellent winning chances. Queen f4 played Alyokhin. Not necessary, so queen e7 was totally good. This idea to prepare rook d8. Maybe white has something like this, like idea. No, but still, it's uh, not pleasant for white. Okay, but queen f4, he played normal move, queen e3. Maybe, uh, so I'm not sure that queen f4 was the best. So queen e7. I like more, I don't why. Probably I'm not totally right, but okay, so I like queen e7 here. After queen a3, I can play also queen f6, immediately attack weak pawn. Why not? Okay, so queen f4 he played, queen e3 now. 
quite consolidate uh, his position somehow because uh, take on e3 is not good it's, uh, from positional point of view oh, also also possible to consider because in chess uh, also there are some questions always there are some questions so, for example rook d8 Still not so easy to make draw. For example, if rook a, oh, bishop d5 is my threat and uh, attack uh, pawn uh, b2. Maybe also I could play bishop d5 immediately. I was afraid knight b6, but even here rook b8. Okay, now knight takes a4. Probably it's enough for draw. Okay, but rook b8. Now, if knight b6, I can take on g2. So it's important. So knight b6 doesn't work. So what to do? Rook a5 looks like the best way. But my, I mean this, this, and uh, just take and this rook end game. What is this? Okay, but it's rook end game. At least white has good chances for draw. Also, not so obvious, but so queen g4, f3, queen g6. So I don't like this maneuver. So queen e7, I would prefer. Ah, if uh, after queen a3, black has even queen d7 to avoid any tricks. It's immediately attack. So, okay, if not queen a3, black is ready to play uh, rook d8. Okay, maybe knight b6, he was not afraid somehow. This idea take knight a4 but uh, it's hardly convincing because uh, rook d8 is coming if knight takes a4 okay queen d7 is even e5 is possible so black will at least uh, win uh, okay d5 queen d6 bishop takes d5 so black will win the pawn so queen e7 was strong in my opinion so queen f4, in my opinion, dubious move. Okay, knight b6, probably I have something even better, I don't know. Okay, maybe queen d7 I can play. Rook c4. Rook c4 is losing, maybe, because bishop d5, a5. Queen c6, and then I can take on g2. It's terrible for white. So, queen f4, I don't like. Uh, I, I could dubious remark. Queen g4, so white consolidates somehow. Position queen c3. King h7. If rook d8, knight c8, it's possible. So queen c2, knight c8. Mm -hmm. Probably Alyokhin wants to play. No, no. Uh, uh, Ava won another game. So I put uh, three games together in one. This uh, game, Ava just survive. We'll see how. Rook c8. Still, uh, white is in trouble, of course, because rook b8 is coming. Okay, very close to win, but bishop b5 he played. f4 immediately was possible. Ну как хуже? Черных, конечно, не хуже у них. 
большие шансы на выигрыш. Другое дело, что не так просто выиграть. У них не хуже. Так, шаг дал. Ну, FOI mid от его способа, but okay, same idea. Now it looks like uh, very close to fortress. Probably black should play something else. Question what? Of course, uh, if uh, allowed to play f4, it will be draw. So if uh, black is doing something like this, f4, this is draw. So black uh, should play something concrete in this position. And Aliochin played bishop. Uh, b5 okay uh, is it any idea oh, okay for, we can consider f4 immediately very natural move so takes takes and what now ah now it's different that uh, white cannot have king on c3 so if knight g2 e5 Takes, takes, so difficult situation for white because uh, if knight goes somewhere, king d4 is coming. So black has some plans like this, this, uh, this, bishop h3, king hd4 okay maybe this is not winning uh, because now can this, but uh, black can try to improve so can okay so from this position how to play okay maybe even this is possible and this for example, if this, this, knight d3, bishop d5, if f4, king c2, and black is winning. Okay, so good winning chances for black, but Aliochin played this. It's a little bit different situation because king on c3. So if f4 immediately, white has no time to go with king on c3. It's because pawn is under attack, so probably it, from that reason, f4 immediately was precise, not uh, allow to move for white king. The same ideas, also. This again, uh, not so sure as that black can win this because if this, uh, this Real Madrid, I don't know, this is end game. Difficult to say for white is enough to give his knight uh, against pawn h6 and uh, go by king to a1, but how to reach it? So. Okay, but uh, I cannot be sure that it's this draw or black can win. So. Uh, how many pieces? Uh, three against ah, so uh, uh, base, it's possible to check. Сегизи база, possible to check. Окей. Okay. Алёхин played this. На g2, and now king c6. So now white has better king, so black has no plan to 
penetrate on uh, his skin. So. And the four square is under control. If, uh, try to explain in a more simple way. And bishop e2, knight e1. And then king d2, and then king c3. So, like, has something like fortress. Probably black has planned to attack uh, h-pawn, but it's a little bit slow. I mean something like this, 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 this. Looks like a little bit slow. King g6 is coming and it looks like draw. Okay, so what Alokhin played? King d6, king c5, knight d4. Knight d4, so not knight a1, so knight e1 was possible. Try to keep this fortress, but Ava decided to play in more active way, knight d4. Okay, uh, if it will be necessary, he can go back to e1. Bishop h3, King d5 was possible, but knight c2. And now King b5. Why King b5? King d5 looks more natural. But probably knight b4, knight takes a6, and white can hold the game. Okay, but we can check at least. Bishop g2 instead of bishop h3 immediately. Uh, ah, uh, here bishop g2. That's also possible. Knight e6, king d6, knight f4, bishop f3. Yes, black has winning chances, but, um, but probably it's draw. It's not a lot of material on the board. Okay, no problem. King b5, okay, now it looks like bishop h5, not natural moves. So h5, I provoke. Bishop f5. So why not king d5? It's very natural idea to attack. Uh, H pawn, so pawn endgame. I hope uh, it's uh, winning for black. Is it? Oh no. Okay, let's check. So what's this? What's A5? Yes, it looks like winning. If king is three, king c4. Okay, so after king d5, what was the problem? Ah, but there is problem that uh, white can try to give his knights against h5 pawn and go to a1 if it's possible. But how? So knight. So this looks like a drawish position because uh, not a lot of material in the board. But um, knight e5, bishop h5, knight c4. I'm not sure that this is correct. Knight d6. So uh, Ava likes uh, to play many moves with knight. Okay, but why not knight d5? So bishop f5 is not natural, but knight d5 is very natural move. And 
King D5 is very natural move, and now King is ready to go to E4, F3, G2, somewhere. So how White will make draw here? It's not obvious for me. So my next move will... Ah, maybe knight takes g4 and king b4. Maybe this is draw. e4, a4, f3, a5, g2, a6, g3. No, it's not draw. Yeah. I consider idea to attack h2 pawn, but why not here to attack h2 pawn? Because knight takes g4 is losing move. If king d3 a5, this is also losing. So one tempi. Black is winning here. So after king d5, still. I don't know. Maybe there is some draw, but. I'm trying to understand, but uh, I don't know, frankly speaking. Looks in practical game, very unpleasant situation for Max Aver. Strangely enough, Alyokhin played bishop f5, so, so probably he calculated wrongly pawn endgame. Or oh, I calculate on what it looks like. En passant? In which position en passant? Bad joke, okay. Nothing bad in my opinion. Okay, so it looks like black still has winning chances. So, for example, this. Okay, king d5. King d5. How white will survive? Okay, very strange moment this so, but Bishop F5 is in my opinion just he lost important tempi, knight c4. It's G6 держать, ну а как ее держать? Ну как ну на G6 пойдете, ну пошел. Как вы там будете ее держать? С G6, когда хочу, я выгоню этого коня слон F5. No, no, no. Uh, white won another game. I put uh, three games in one together. So, this is third game. This is game uh, um, 38. I, before I considered game 26 and game 27. Okay, so um, strange. Bishop f5 is now. Okay, now maybe knight d king d5 is possible as well, but uh, black lost important temp and 
this uh, terms are very important so for example this this uh, this is maybe already drawn I'm not still sure but okay also it's possible to check because H pawn is dangerous so maybe even here but before is coming so each temp is but is it draw H3, H2 and black is winning now. So maybe even here can be five. But okay, uh, there is no logic uh, to play bishop f5 because g4 is good. G4 is very good square for black bishop. So king d5. Ah, but now maybe pawn endgame is drawish. Knight is three, taking b4, g4, a4, h3, a5, h2, h6, h4, b4. This is draw. Ah, now this is draw. This is problem. So each temp is important. So King d5 uh, now doesn't work because knight e3 check. So bishop e4, knight d2, bishop g2, h4. Okay, now white consolidates the position. King d5, knight c4. King e4, knight d6. King d5. What is this? Ah, now I understand. If king f4, knight e8. Is possible and white plan is simple give his knight for example king g4 this this b4 and this And this is draw. King b2, king a1 is coming, and this is draw. Okay, but uh, in after my proposition, after king d5 immediately, maybe king d5, maybe white can... Ah, but how to... Ah, king d5, it's also good that uh, not easy to reach the square for the eight square for knights. So if knight c4 now, king e4. Okay, maybe even here white can try this. Knight c4, if uh, so, more or less same idea. Knight d6, king f4. Something like h4. This idea of king g3, knight e8. Ah, but now, uh, now probably white is losing because black can uh, play bishop d1. White didn't play b4 or b3, so. This is uh, this is maybe a losing position for white. At least looks like. So after king d5, black has excellent winning chances. But okay. Uh, where uh, uh, in this line? Uh, go to a1, but how it is draw? It's it's not a draw. Oh, this is drawn. Ah, white is losing if they have also a three pawn, but now ah now maybe it's drawn. Uh, yeah, right. Yes, exactly. This is drawn. 
Yes, this is the draw. You are right. Okay, so black cannot win this. Uh, but uh, just a moment. Knight g7. Maybe black can try not allow this. Ah, but king would go. Ah, but sorry. Uh, I can try this. If king c1, bishop a2. And please show me where is draw. Okay, without pawn a6, white has idea knight takes h5, before a takes, uh, I will show you. So, for example, this, this, this is draw, but without pawn on a6. But with pawn a6, this is winning. So, black is winning here. Ну, с компьютером, да, можно проверить, но я, когда комментирую, то компьютер не беру для проверки. Пытаюсь объяснять людям, что я думаю, своей головой вообще. I'm explaining that I'm not using uh, uh, computer uh, during the Twitch, I'm trying to think with my own heads. Probably I'm making uh, a lot of mistakes. I don't know, but at least I'm trying to explain my understanding of, of chess, of position. I demonstrate what I see. Иногда знаю, иногда нет. So... I cannot know all of correct, but now knight e8, so black has no time to take h pawn and uh, block uh, white uh, the king to go to a1. So this is draw. And this. Okay, so. Now draw is obvious and also obvious that I need to go to sleep. Thanks for attention. Any wishes for next session? Good night. Tal, okay. Tal games, okay.
A little wee. Ow. No. The moves is At the floor. Just stay up, use high ground. The door's on. Дивись, от що я зробив, от значить, от відео я сьогодні зробив, ну, переважно, що от, ну, якось отак, що можна його подивитися, почути, потім save changes, а тут чомусь воно так вискочило, що ви таке. А що не пишемо? Ну, unpublish, publish. А ви по себе не publish? Ну, я пишу publish, yes, але я перед тим мав вже ж послухати і зробити save changes. Щоб не мав зайти? А як не мав зайти? 
Ну, я бы сюда заходил. За... Сюда? На текст. На текст? Так. На текст. А у вас ключ не ключ? Вибачте, у вас команд ключ. А, я не закрыл. А, вот в чем Ну, ну, и ну, и шо, чка, чка, ну, вот. А, я Endstream забыл. Ну, елки, елки. Ну, елки. Exit, че шо? Exit. Чекай, шо ты? Ты забыл Endstream написано. Exit.